So we're on uh, the boardwalk on uh, Venice Beach. So hello! And oh look, dog dog defecation must be removed. So no, be don't be defecating on the beach, man. So <laughs> wow, look at that! So <clears throat> a few years ago, on a um, December, round right about this time, I was away. actually it was this time because I've just seen the memories in Facebook. I was away on a course, like a higher consciousness mastery course thing, down in Florida for a couple of weeks. And when I left New York, it was about 65 degrees, so I dressed as I normally do. And when I came back to New York two weeks later, at three in the morning on Jamaica Station Subway, it was 10 fucking degrees, and I was dressed the same. And I just went, "Fuck that! Why am I living in the cold?" So I made a plan the year after to not be in the cold for the winter. And all was going well. And I had my final Krav Maga instruction course, blah, 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 that would have or should have funded me through the winter. And, you know, I did it the week before uh, Christmas, a month before a bunch of people bailed out. I had to scramble, discount, blah, 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 to keep the course on. We did it. However, more than that, so this is the week before Christmas last year, I was planning to be in Key West for the winter. Sadly, that week, two NYPD officers got shot dead down the street from where I train. So my phone starts going, as it always does when shit happens in the world. My phone gets busy, then people forget about it and blah, 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 and a few of them do something about it. Same stuff's going on now. <clears throat> However, it was like, can we do this? Can we do that? Can you train? Can you train? I thought, yeah, you know what? A few more weeks won't hurt. And then it got to... Fuck, this place is cool, man. Then it got to the middle of January, and I thought, oh, fuck it, you know? The w wow! What the fuck? You see this place, B? With the, with the gun tower? Oh, yeah. That's cool, man. Is that someone's home? That's someone's home. AFA, que paso, man? So, <clears throat> got to the middle of uh, January, and I thought, Fuck it, winter's almost over, may as well stay. However, winter hadn't even started. So that time, I was absolutely determined never to spend... I love New York City. I love New York City. I fucking hate winter. So why be there? So I was determined not to spend another winter there. So, you know, over the last... Three or four days I've been in the sun, having fun. Uh, we've been working hard. Have we been working hard? Real hard. Well, kind of. The phones have been busy. Okay. Training with the magic counts as work. Smart work is, is, is very different. Training with the Orlando magic counts as work, yeah, buddy. That does. That does. Okay. I'm glad you were working this morning. I was working by the pool with a book. So. This isn't by chance that we're here right now. This was planned a year ago. Did everything run smoothly? No, everything went fucking wrong. Without going into details. I had to reboot and reboot and reboot and reboot. And we rebooted when? Last week in May? Last week in May, buddy. We rebooted again and went again. Has it been smooth sailing to get to this point? No, not at all. However, Here's the lesson for today. Just keep going. Just keep going. Because you know, if you believe in something enough, and you have enough conviction, that will come across. And just keep swinging, in the words of Babe Ruth. So, there's no luck involved that we're here. It was planned to be in the sun for the winter. Maybe not specifically on Venice Beach, however, this was a place I was looking at living. I'd fit in here, but I'm really decided I'm not loving LA with the traffic. That traffic's a, you know, for a guy that doesn't drive, it's probably the wrong city to be in. Um, however, the most common thing I've heard in the last four days is, you guys are so lucky, or I wish I was doing it. 
there's no luck. We fucking hustle our ass off. We just make it look easy. So the only luck is looking easy. Do you have any words for the world on that subject? Tony World for the any work. You, you know, you gotta enjoy what you do, or else, you know, you know, Gary Vanderchuk talks about it all the time. If you're waking up every day and you dread what you're doing, why the hell are you doing it? So, when we say we're working our asses off, it's disguised as fun. I know that's weird, but that's just how we roll. So, yep. Yeah. You know what? I heard a great one last week from Gary Vaynerchuk. I, two weeks ago, he came up with, you know that shit you hate? Stop doing it. Last week, he did a great one. Was, you know that stuff you love? Just fucking do that. Okay. Right. It doesn't... <laughs> yeah, that's it. Don't do the shit you hate and do the stuff you love. So, you know, you wish you were here. Here's your chance. We're floating around, we're flying around, where we're going, we're going to San, San Fran, then Spokane, Portland, and Seattle, but it's like in and out, in and out, in and out, in and out. So, keep plugged in, it'll be on the Book of Face, if you want to meet up, whatever. Uh, let's do that. So guys, if you want to do, be doing this stuff in a few months, all you got to do is reach out and ask and go, what the fuck is it you two guys do? We drive around in a jeep, basically. Anyway, there's food here, so we can't be talking any longer because Brian, Brian, Brian looks like he needs a meal. Are we, are we not getting the, we're not getting the pump, the flex. No. No. Okay, that's the one. <laughs>